It's the Music City Show, starring Tim Lovelace, the Blue Jean Band, the Positive Cowboy, Jim Sheldon, and our special guest today, Mark Trammell Quartet. Would you please welcome Tim Lovelace. Yeah. That blue jean band is jumping on it right there. Well, welcome to the Music City Show. We're so glad you're joining us. And I'm excited about a friend of mine who is here today. And man, can he sing and his group, Mark Trammell. Now, Mark, he's got a rich history in gospel music. He's been with the award-winning Kingsman, Gold City, Greater Vision, and none other than the one and only group, the Cathedrals, for many years. And he learned so much over the years with all these great groups, and now he has his own group. What about it? Right here on the Music City Show, Mark Trammell Quartet. Yeah. <laughs> Don't stop running till you beat, hit the golden street till the pearly gates unfold. Don't stop running till you meet your loved ones, greet them with a half has never been told. Even when the world may make you stumble, never lose sight of what's in store. Don't stop running till you reach that land on the heavenly shore. Now we are in this race together, every step and every mile. Through the clouds and stormy weather, we may struggle all the while. But we cannot lose our focus, helping others all the way. Ever serving, ever love, and ever trust and come what may. Don't stop running till you meet hit the golden street till the pearly gates unfold. Don't stop running till you meet your loved ones. Freedom with a half has never been told. Even when the world may make you stumble, never lose sight of what's in store. Don't stop running till you reach that land on the heavenly shore. Now earthly things may often sway you, fleshly thoughts may cross your mind. Doubt and fear may try to fail you, try to leave you far behind. But he promised to deliver those who trusted in his name. Just like Daniel, just like Moses, just for you, he'll do the same. Don't stop running till you meet in the golden street till the pearly gates unfold. Don't stop running till you meet your loved ones. Freedom with a half has never been told. Even when the world may make you stumble, never lose sight of what's in store. Don't stop running till you reach that land on the heavenly shore. Till the glory bells for you have rung. Till the crown of life your soul has won. Till you hear the Savior say, well, I Don't stop running till you beat in the golden streets. Till the pearly gates unfold. Don't stop running till you reach your loved ones. Freedom with a half has never been told. Even when the world may make you stumble, never lose sight of what's in store. Don't stop running till you reach that land on the heavenly shore. Even when the world may make you stumble, never lose sight of what's in store. Don't stop running till you reach that land on the heavenly shore. That was a new song, and this one is a new song that we're about to do for you. I love the message in this new song right here. It talks about me, and it may talk about you as well. Let's see if it does. When the Lord found me wandering aimlessly, lost and
Through the years he's been my unfailing friend Every longing satisfied on the mountain Excited that you are here, all of you guys. One more time. Didn't Mark Trammell, didn't they do a great job singing? Yes. There's some exciting things going on. And I told everybody uh, in the beginning about some of your rich history as far as the groups you've been in. You started when you were two or were you three? I'm not really I had sure. Ju- I had just turned three. Thank just you. turned yeah. three, yeah. yeah. You had to be old enough to drive the right. bus. Yes, right. Yes, okay. But, but, but you've been in gospel music for... Uh, 40 years. 40 years. Last August was 40, 40 years. 40 years, and you're 45, I'm and that 45. is also... Yes. No, 43. <laughs> 43. 43. And... Um, uh, all those years with, with the different groups, and then the uh, uh, you were the cathedrals. How many? Ten. A little ten? over ten years. Huh? Wow, a decade with them. Yeah. And uh, learning from George and Glenn. Man, some yeah. of the sweetest days in my life, Tim, was with uh, George and Glenn. In fact, I did not know. You can understand this because you've been out here almost as long as I have, if not longer, in some respects. Mm-hmm. But uh, I did not know how to appreciate where I was until after I was gone. I did not know the value of being in the lives of Glenn Payne and George Johnson until after I had left there. And I understood it to a certain level, to a certain degree. But after I left there, I thought, my goodness, I I catch myself doing things that either one of those two old men could do on any given day, thinking the same kinds of things they're thinking uh, about people, about songs that we sing to people, yeah. about how to treat people, all of those things, right, you know, right. mistakes that, that I make that are insignificant to the whole world, but they're important to me because I might say something that would offend someone that I wouldn't intentionally do for a million dollars. Right, right. But you have, they just taught you how to be careful and how to love people. And the most important thing they taught the young guys that were a part of their lives is if you'll learn to love those people sitting out there in those seats, they will love you back. And they have me for 40 years now, and I love that. Well, uh, you know, Mark, I think a lot of times um, when a young group is starting out, they feel like if we have the harmony, if we can if we can get that bass singer and that tenor or whatever kind of music it is, I don't, it doesn't really matter the genre. They're just thinking, if we can sing and pick, we've got it made. Yeah. 
But the business side is one thing, and the personal side, the sincerity side, what you're talking about. Truly when is. you really love people, whether you say it or not, it comes across. Yeah. And George and Glenn, I mean, there was a reason why they, they were so, you know, uh, successful. They, yes, and I, I believe that 90% uh, of their success was the fact that uh, they did love people. Right. They, uh, they were a people person, both of them were. Well, let me shift gears a little bit. Um, uh, your group you have today, uh, why don't we just real quickly, we'll just kind of go around in a circle, uh, although I know everybody, for anybody watching, tell them your name, where you're from, and try to tell the truth. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm starting with a bass singer. <laughs> try to tell the truth. I don't know. We pick on bass singers. I'm Randy Bird. I'm from Rome, Georgia. I'm Dustin Black, and I am from Gadsden, Alabama, by way of Saginaw, Michigan. Okay. I'm Nick Trammell. I'm from Gazin, Alabama, by way of Stowe, Ohio, when he was <laughs> yes. at the cathedral. And your, your baby I'm, boy is now singing And with my you. baby boy is sitting next to me on the couch with you yes. being our interviewer today. Can, can you believe it? I ran across a, a, a picture. I'm going to see if we That's can have it that right we can there. fly uh, uh, maybe later on. But when we would go on singing at sea, and, and Nick was just... Uh, he'd come out with his little oh, yeah. bow ties yes. and just love the music. Yeah. And I've got a picture of me holding yes. Nick. Yes. And now Nick has presented, he and his wife has presented you with some grandchildren? Yes, beautiful. The most perfect, two most perfect <laughs> children in the, in the entire world. The one yes. that's old enough to talk, she calls me Papa. Oh, it changed and, everything. Oh, and it? when she says Papa... And she'll turn that little head just right. She can have anything she wants. Yes. And you saying, what kind of car do you want? Yeah. Yes, yeah. okay. No, I don't say that. He says <laughs> yeah. that. Now, um, the Mark Trammell Quartet, your latest project is called? Your Walk Talks. Your Walk Talks, which was written by? Uh, let's see. Writers. Nick, so I know writer. you Rodney write. Griffin. No, Rodney Griffin and Babby Mason wrote that song. Rodney and Babby, that's, yeah. that's a nice co combination. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, and you do, you have your homecoming, you have different events that you all do and go all over the country. Yeah. How, did, how, did you find, how did you find this boy from Michigan? That's a funny story a that I don't know you have time for. Have. Let, let me tell a real quick version of the story of, of the kid from Saginaw, Michigan, okay? <laughs> the quick version is... Standing in my kitchen, trying out. I ask questions before people get on my bus. I ask questions. I want to know something about him. Now he starts telling me where he's from. He's from Saginaw, Michigan. I thought, okay, I've been singing 40 years. I've never sung with a Yankee up to this point. <laughs> so I don't know how that's going to go. But I mean, I'm fine with it. I just, I've never have. So, but in all of that time, we have figured out uh, how to, uh, we finally taught him how after two years of being with us, he now knows how to make his very own vine ripe tomato sandwich. Yes. All right. He understands the importance of that, and he also understands the importance of putting mayonnaise on both pieces of bread. <laughs> well, he but, can, he but now it drinks. all balances out. My wife's from Ohio, and she's teaching me English. Oh, so okay. it, all, it, all, it all balances. I mean, we teach each other. He loves sweet iced tea, so I think he's going to be okay. <laughs> well, everybody loves that. Everybody loves that, that, that bass and tenor thing. Yeah, oh, yeah. They do a great job. And, and, uh, they, as it, long as they show up, we're, everybody's fine. Well, <laughs> If we show up, they really don't care whether we do or not. As long as the high and the low gets there, it's all good. In a well, I know, one thing, I know one thing. If you get a chance to go out and hear the Mark Trammell Quartet, uh, and you can't fire him. He's not only a great talent, but he's the daddy of, of your grandchildren. Yeah, my grandchildren. But, uh, <laughs> but you need to go out and hear them. They are just going all over the country doing such a great job. And, and Mark, it's been great talking to you, but you know, uh, 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 we've got to pitch it and go down, go down to the barn. Uh, will you let me do that? Well, you mean like come around here? I mean, uh, would I you see? let me? I want, I'm, yeah, we've I'm, already I'm, talked I'm about always... all the jobs you had, now you want to take mine. I've... <laughs> I've... All right. Come can on I, around here. Okay. You can, can I, do it. You don't mind? Not at all. Not at all. Howdy, guys. How you doing? Okay. Just help yourself. Are you ready? Go for it. Hey, let's take it down to the barn and see what Jim's doing. Yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good. Alas, to live my Savior please, and did my Sovereign die? Would He devote a sacred hymn for such a worm as I? At 
the cross, at the cross, where I first saw the light, and the burden of my heart rolled away. It was there by faith I received my sight, and now I am happy all the day. Was it for crimes that I had done? He groaned upon the tree. Amazing pity, grace unknown, and love beyond degree. But trust of faith can never repay the debt of love I owe. Hey Lord, I give myself away is all that I can do. At the cross, at the cross, where I first saw the light, and the burden of my heart rolled away. It was there by faith I received my sight, and now I am happy all the day. At the cross, at the cross, where I first saw the light, and the burden of my heart rolled away. It was there by faith I received my sight, and now I am happy all the day. It was there by faith I received my sight, and now I am happy all the day.
job down there. Appreciate that song. Great job. Thank you, Tim. Appreciate it. And you know what? I love great songs, so we just need to keep it going. What about it one more time? The Mark Trammell Quartet. Yes. <laughs> Listen to one of our most uh, popular songs. It says, You Walk Talks. Walk, walk, talks. Talks, walk, walk, talks. Talks, walk, walk, talks. Talks, walk, talks. There's an account we read about the Pharisees in the Bible days way back when. How they criticized the Lord Jesus Christ for eating with sinful men. Jesus heard to say, Love is the only way. So let your actions speak louder than your words. Though the years have passed, this truth will last A lesson that we all can learn You know your walk talks and your talk talks But your walk talks louder than your talk talks Your behavior toward your neighbor Tells really how you feel about the Savior 
When you exemplify and shine the light of Christ, you know the number in the kingdom will be multiplied. Yes, your walk talks and your talk talks, but your walk talks louder than your talk talks. Walk talks, walk talks, walk talks, walk talks, walk talks, walk talks. What did you do today to give your love away to a lost and hurting soul? Did you lend a hand to your fellow man and help him on down the road? When we illuminate, we chase the dark away, so let your little light shine. When we follow through with what we say and do, the Father will be glorified. You know your walk talks and your talk talks, but you walk talks louder than you talk talks. Your behavior toward your neighbor is really how you feel about the same. When you exemplify and shine the light of Christ, you know the number in the kingdom will be multiplied. Yes, your walk talks and your talk talks, but your walk talks louder than your talk talks. Do those things that Christ would do, be loving, kind, and caring. Preach the gospel to all men, use words when necessary. You know your walk talks and your talk talks. You all talk louder than you talk talk. Your behavior towards your neighbor is really how you feel about the same. When you exemplify and shine the light of Christ, you know the number in the kingdom will be multiplied. And it's your walk talks and your talk talks, but your walk talks louder than your talk talks. So your walk talks and your talk talks, but your walk talks louder than your talk talks. Awesome job. Well, thanks for joining us today on the Music City Show. And you can find out what's coming up next by following us on social media, or you can go to our website, themusiccityshow.com. We've enjoyed our featured guest, Mark Trammell Quartet. Yeah. Awesome, man. The Positive Cowboy, Jim Sheldon. And all of the Blue Jean Band. So tune in next week, same time, same place. We'll be 